to Vault 112, resident. According to sensors, you have arrived 202.3 years behind schedule. Please redress in your Vault Tech issued Vault suit before proceeding. If you have misplaced your suit, I am authorized to distribute a new one. Once dressed, please proceed down the stairs to the main floor so that you may enter your assigned Tranquility Lounger. Cooperation. Someone new to play with. What good luck I have lately. I was just starting to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. This is Tranquility Lane. We all live here, and now so do you. Do you like games? I love to play games. I know a really fun game we can play. <laughs> you don't get to say no. If I want to play a game, you're going to play. And I want to. I said I want to play a game. It's easy. You make Timmy Newsbaum cry, and I'll help you. If you don't, then I guess you're stuck here. Well, maybe you feel that way. I really don't like it. What can I do for you, sport? Betty? Well, she's Betty, you know. You really shouldn't keep her waiting. What if something goes wrong? Oh, Mabel, you worry too much. It's fine. Well, hi there. Heck of a place to live. Janet and I, well, we're quite happy here. Take care now. Well, hi there. 
It's your sport, whatever you say. <laughs> what you've done! You've triggered the failsafe! Ruined everything! The subjects will die and I'll be stuck here in this hell alone! You ruined everything! Everything! It is not over! It is not over until I say so! Do you understand me? I... 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 I just want things to go back the way they were. He's been right here the whole time. And you were too dense to figure it out. The dog, you see. Man's best friend. But now you've taken all my friends from me. The Garden of Eden creation kit. It was for terraforming. For restoring the world after a nuclear disaster. Unstable technology, and ultimately boring. Why remake the old reality when instead you could create any reality you choose? Run along now! Son, you've saved me. I was afraid I'd be trapped in there forever. It's so good to see you, but... but what are you doing here? Well, I'm glad you did. This certainly wasn't how I expected things to turn out. I wasn't ready for brawn, or I might have fared better. Well, I suppose it had its moments. But in the end, I much prefer having opposable thumbs. 
And now that I'm back, I can get back to work. I need to tell Madison what I've learned. I was right about Braun. The technology he developed is unstable, even dangerous. But it can be adapted for Project Purity. I need to return to Rivet City and talk with Madison. If we can find a Gek, we can make Project Purity work. Yes, with what I've learned, Madison is sure to see that we can finally succeed where we failed so many years ago. I'd like you to come with me. I'd like you to be there when we finally open the floodgates. That's my boy. Let's hurry. Now that I know what we need, I want to get back to work as soon as possible. Be careful, my son. the vegetable. What can I do for you? Farewell. They're fragile. I 
I told you it would work, Madison. And now I can prove it. James, you're back. And with good news. I was right about Braun and the Gek. If we can find one, we can adapt it to work with the purifiers. I'd like to believe you, James. I really would. This is all just so... so sudden. Madison, I'm telling you, this is real. I talked to Braun himself. Confirmed it. Don't you see? This is what we've been waiting for. I... I don't know, James. So many years have passed. Is it really still worth trying? How could it not be worth improving the lives of everyone in the Wasteland? What could be a more worthy endeavor? You haven't lost any of your passion, have you, James? It's as important to me as ever, Madison. I know it's important to you, too. Let's finish it together. James, I... We don't have a Gek. I can get a small team together, but we'll need proof that it works before people believe us. I know. I was thinking about that. The lab at the facility had some old pre-war computers that we scavenged. One of them might be useful. From the last reports, there's no power at the facility. Even if one of those computers had a database, we couldn't access it. That's why we're going to head over there right now and get things up and running as best we can. You know, if it were anyone else asking me to do this, I'd have them run right out of Rivet City. And you know I wouldn't be here if I didn't think this would really work. It's time, Madison. Damn you, James. When this is all over, you owe me a drink. I'll get the team together. Thank you, Madison. It's good to be working with you again. Did you need something? Is everything all right? We need to get back to Project Purity. The computer there is our best chance to locate a Gek. That's my boy. It'll be good to work side by side with you, son. More games!
Are you all right? Is it safe in there? I'm proud of you. Now let's get in there. It started as an idea, really. Remember the Bible passage your mother loved so much? Free, clean water for everyone. What a difference it could make in the lives of everyone here in the Wastes. Over time, that idea took the form of a purifier. Not like the one in the vault, though. This one was gigantic, capable of purifying millions of gallons of water at once. We used the old Jefferson Memorial for the location, right on DC's tidal basin. Someday soon, I hope you'll see it work. Be careful, my son. Hello, son. Oh, great. Oh, great. Listen, I know who you are, okay? Far as I'm concerned, you've got no business being here. So just stay out of my way. Keep your hands to yourself in there. This equipment is fragile. Here we are, where it all began. You remember your mother's favorite passage? Revelation 21.6 I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. Don't you see? This is what it all means. The water, the purifier. This is the water of life. Your mother's dream. No point in wasting time. Let's get to work. There's much to be done. Be careful, my son. What can I do for you? I have faith in your father. With the knowledge he's gained, we stand a better chance than we ever have. Farewell.
Aufmerksam. Just be careful what you touch in here, okay? The equipment's old enough as it is. I sure hope so. Or it's just going to crush Dr. Lee completely. Especially after your father came back and all. So long. Watch where you're going. Did you need something? Here we are. Revel. Don't you. The project was abandoned shortly after you were born. Things have deteriorated here since then, and there's been some flooding. I need you to get to the flood control pumps and activate them so we can clear out the water and reach the mainframe. The automatic doors sealed when the flooding occurred, so you'll have to use the access tunnels to reach the pumps. doing great out there. Keep it up. I'll see you when you get back. Great work on the pumps. Hurry back, and I'll give you the fuses you need. Did you need something? Yes? I've been hearing good things about you. Is it true? Did you really disarm the bomb and Megaton? I'm very proud of you, even though you put yourself in harm's way. Just please be careful out there. This is a dangerous world. Far more dangerous than anyone in that vault knows. Right. The flooding shorted out some of the fuse boxes downstairs, including one that controls some of the automatic doors. Here, take these fuses. The box is back down in the sub-basement near the eastern end of the level. Once the fuses are replaced, you'll be able to get to the mainframe. How's it going?
fuse is in place, you should be able to access the mainframe. No need to come back to the control room. Just head straight there. A few minor repairs still to be made up here in the control room. Why don't you come back here and give me a hand? Actually, wait. There's one other thing I need you to do. Jana says there's a blockage in one of the intake pipes. It's on your way back. Head back up to the museum level and give me a call on the intercom when you get there. Keep up the good work, son. Hey. be just outside the pipe that's been giving us trouble. Now don't worry, this isn't dangerous at all. Just get inside and use the manual controls to drain the pipe. That'll break up the debris enough for the filters to function properly. Now I won't be able to contact you once you're in there. You'll exit near the systems, and then you can get in touch with me again.
by the what authority of the there? president, this facility is now under United States government control. The person in charge is to step forward immediately and turn over all materials related to this project. That's quite impossible. This is a private project. The Enclave has no authority here. I'm going to have to ask you to leave at once. Am I to assume, sir, that you are in charge? Yes, I'm responsible for this project. Then I repeat, sir, that you are hereby instructed to immediately hand over all materials related to the purifier. I'm sorry, but that's... Furthermore, you are to assist Enclave scientists in assuming control of the administration and operation of this facility at once. Colonel, is it, Colonel? I'm sorry, but the facility is not operational. It never has been. I'm afraid you're wasting your time here. Sir, this is the last time I am going to repeat myself. Stand down at once and turn over control of this facility. Colonel, I assure you that this facility will not function. We have never been able to successfully replicate test results. I suggest you comply immediately, sir, in order to prevent any more incidents. Are we clear? Yes, Colonel. Do whatever you want. There's no need for more violence. Then you will immediately hand over all materials related to this project and aid us in making it operational at once. Very well. Give me a few moments to bring the system on. Enough of these delays. Almost ready. I'm compiling the data now. Run. Run! What is he doing in there? James. He's gone. We have to get out of here. They'll be coming for us next. We've got to evacuate now! There's an old tunnel that will lead us out of here to someplace safe. We used it as an evacuation route once before, but that was a long time ago. I hope everyone remembers how to get there. There isn't time to round everyone up. Come on, follow me, and hurry! What is going on up there? We need to escape while we can. Don't wander off, we're going to need you. This tunnel leads to the Citadel, the Brotherhood of Steel's Fortress. We should be safe there, if we can make it. We're underground. No one's been down here for a long time. Odds are, we're not alone. Understand me? We don't have time to waste, we need to get moving. Don't wander off. We're going to need you. You heard... We've... We need to stick together. We'll be right behind you. Be careful. What did you do? Is it? Are you sure? I don't want to stay in one. And what about the slavers of Paradise Falls?
What is it? There's a locked door up ahead. I can open it, but it'll take some time. Over here. We can't go any further. We need to stop. Garza is in need of medical attention immediately. I don't have sufficient medical... Yes, this looks to be enough. He'll need medical attention once we've reached the Citadel, but this will get him there. Thank you. Give me a moment and we can continue.
enclave troops in your town, in your settlements. with your presence here. Name's Paladin Bale. What do you need, civilian? Of course. But you'd have to secure the permission of Elder Lions and, well, I just don't see that happening. So move along. I am Dr. Madison Lee. I have people with me in need of shelter. You must allow us access at once. I'm sorry, ma'am. No unauthorized civilians allowed inside the Citadel. You'll have to leave now. Lions! I know you're in there! I know you can hear me! You open this goddamn door right now! 